Ben says Gagnon his here you want to work with an influencer and you're wondering how do you go about it how do you go about contacting an influencer you've been sending them messages you've been posting on their stuff you've been commenting on their things you've been like there and they're not getting back to you they're not getting back to you they're not working with you you've got this awesome idea you want them to work with you but it's just not working so how do you do it how do you get to a point where you work with an influencer where you get involved with something that they're working with or maybe they they get connected with you and how do you get that to happen how do you get an influencer to work with you you're just starting out you have no followers you have no content you're just wanting to work with influence because you know if you work with one influencer you heard Russell Brunson talk about it he says just build your dream 100 connect 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 have conversations and eventually one will say yes right but how do you make that happen what do you need to do to work with an influencer we're going to talk about that in just a second but first this so the real question is this what are the strategies techniques and tools that you need to learn to generate residual income from the e-learning boom that's happening right now my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon and welcome to Course Income Secrets all right so I'm talking about getting connected with a TikTok what do I say TikTok influencer obviously it could be a LinkedIn influencer it could be a Facebook influencer it could be a Instagram Snapchat any of the platforms Pinterest YouTube you name it it could be any of those platforms it doesn't have to be TikTok I'm only talking about TikTok because I was able to get to to work with a TikTok influencer that has two million followers well, two million followers now she used to have 1.7 million when I first got connected with her for four five almost five months ago now and we we built a course together and we promoted it together and it's you know so we worked together how did I get that happen I only have you know at the time I had 200 followers on TikTok just 200 and I was able to work with her so how did I do that so we're going to talk about how that can happen for you as well and what you need to do to get that to happen so first of all let me just kind of show you my the backstory here of how uh, of what uh, the process was for me uh, if I go back and I share my screen right here let me share my screen come on. all right so um let's just move this a little bit there there we go let's put that like this there we go okay so actually right down this way right there all right so this is just a video I posted five months ago I don't know if you can see the actual date one here no I guess not okay so five months ago I posted this video here you it just says to be continued but I mean if I was to restart it I'm not gonna play it with the same hey my friend yeah so I mean this is just a video I posted I talked about you know TikTok Gary V and I just basically posted something about and I that I was going to do a TikTok tutorial I just and this is this is what you have to do too right you've got to be posting content you've got to be creating content you can't just be talking to influencers not doing anything you got to work as if it all depended on you and connect you can't be assuming that you, you can't be needing the influencer right you got to work as if it all depended on you right so that's what I was doing I I never even thought of connecting with influencer that I could find an influencer I just kept posting right I mean here's another post I did uh four things uh that I did again five months ago um things you got to do in your videos I was just I just post content I'm doing that now right I'm posting content to kind of teach you some of the things I know how how I uh how I how I do things so maybe you can do them right I'm just I just post things like that and then I started posting on TikTok I started saying okay hey I started using TikTok and I was actually talking to one of my mentors and he was saying you should do a TikTok course man you you've learned it so fast you know how to use the app you know how to do some videos that are getting pretty good views I mean as a newbie that was just starting in TikTok it was I was doing good for a newbie right and uh, because of my niche it's not you know a niche that's the <laughs> necessarily the the hottest niche <coughs> on TikTok but I was doing good for my niche for the amount of uh time I so I did things like this I would share my TikTok videos I would do things I would post things and then eventually this is what happened I posted this video here 
which I after my my mentor told me you should do a course I, I said okay I'm just going to take the next month and I'm going to do a TikTok course and I kind of put it together laid out how to do it what to do what I would do and I and I started showing in these videos I sh started showing you know that I would do a course and this is what it kind of would look like you know you'd have the camera on one side the the phone on the other side and then me talking in the middle kind of thing explaining things showing things how they work and all that and that was before the days of TikTok having a, a website right so I would do that I would I, and I posted this video and as you can see right there I that was actually a morning video like even before showering I wasn't even dr dressed yet I just had my my white shirt on just my and and t-shirt and I hadn't even and I just did that I just thought you know what I'm just going to post something I'm just going to let people know it's coming here's what it's kind of kind of look like and actually even before that though I did post uh is this one of course uh if you follow Gary V you know a lot about TikTok uh so it's set up and like getting that mixed yeah so this is exactly tune in for a quick to TikTok tutorial for entrepreneurs so I was actually starting to talk about the TikTok how I was going to show people how to do it uh for entrepreneurs that kind of thing and then when I posted this as you can see right here there was a comment from Maya Gordon I had no clue who she was I hadn't even seen her on TikTok but she saw this she's been she today she's doing amazing of course you can look her up she's doing amazing she's doing lots of things on social media on LinkedIn on TikTok she's doing lots of things definitely reach out and connect with her tell her that you saw this that you heard about her through me um and but you know at the time she just she just said this she just saw this video she thought oh this guy you know whatever I don't know what she thought but obviously she thought I looked like I knew what I was doing enough to reach out and talk to me right so she said we should partner on this I see a huge I could add huge credibility insights and reach to your course and I was like I don't know who that is but I said sounds interesting let's connect and chat about that and that's that's the only thing that happened in that post that I did I just posted that then what happened is we had a conversation right uh that's not it this one here so we had a conversation oh you can't see it let's move this over here so we had a conversation so basically I just said send her a message I said hi Mayan you commented on my TikTok post about collaborating what did you have in mind right so then she just said I'd love to do a partnership on it where I can contribute some of the content and you can use my name and the accolades to promote it in exchange for a percentage share if you google TikTok consultant I'm the top person that pops up on Google and have done more than 30 podcast episodes speaking on the platform and also just spoke at two conferences right so she obviously was telling me what she's about what she does uh, obviously I didn't know her so she just said let me know if you have any questions for me or if you're interested to hop on a phone call please feel free to schedule time through my calendar so I actually booked something uh, in her calendar at the time I uh, kind of told her a little bit what I was doing I said wow well, yes of course that would be of interest to me my plan was to do initial free release to just get 20 to 50 people in and get me feedback then release the course at 97 it is a basic course after all with an initial launch at 50 percent off the first week of release I was planning on giving 50 percent commission on the course but would go higher in exchange for exposure for sure so that was my initial for me it was half and half and it still is now by the way so if you do go get the course at tiktokabc.com if you get that there actually you can go to course.tiktokabc.com you can get the course directly there uh, I'm not even sure if it's still showing up at 97 or what the price is but if you have questions just reach out anyways and the thing is that she's still getting 50 percent whenever I sell that it's still hers man the thing is that I um we had a conversation right we had a conversation then I started looking her up right I started like as you can see right here this is her profile so you know she's got you know 750 million video views two million followers when I first uh met her um five months ago that was 1.7 million followers right and obviously less video views but she's been growing um she's got lots of connections lots of followers she's got 26,000 followers right even that's I've got 16,000 I think so you know she is definitely a, um, a, a an influencer she has influence and in the TikTok world if you look if you go to look her page on world of glass you see that she's got 40 million likes now what does she have here 
oh there's views she's saying views okay yeah you can't really see views in the profile of somebody else she would know but you can see look she's doing 36,000 views here 10,000 views here 25,000 views here 808,000 almost a million views on this video 31 to 29 32 I mean she knows how to use TikTok so what happened so we had this uh basically what we did so we worked through us and I started talking about how I'm you know we're going to do a TikTok course and uh, how she's connected with me now she started posting things about what she's doing and she started posting things so then I started showing about the TikTok right still available it was available for free in the beginning obviously it's not anymore uh and then you know I was gonna and then I started posting about TikTok what I do that kind of stuff and the Mayan obviously started to talk more about what she does here's here's the other here's another video I think maybe that's actually the same one yeah that's the same video but that was on my page or profile instead of my page yeah this one here yeah this one here was on my page right then the other one was on my profile same video but she commented on the one on my page and then we started you know connecting we started and I started posting things on Facebook I started posting things everywhere about the course starting creating the course started talking then I had an interview with her we had a couple interviews and we talked about TikTok in general she was amazing she knows so much about TikTok and as you can see look it was 1.7 million at the time 37 million likes uh and then this the course I created we created the course and the course was uh we did a webinar and we did uh the course uh, release and all that stuff there's what else can I show you and then what she did is she put together a case study she put together a free case study that we would give away for people to come to the webinar which by the way if you go to tiktokabc.com and you put your name and email you're going to get this free case study as well so that's still available it's still on the table it's basically a tiktok case study that she put together but look at this one thousand two two oh sorry two thousand two hundred comments so that's that was organic reach that's I mean there there's still people commenting these days but it's mainly something that was put together and for some reason because TikTok was such a hot topic and because Mayan was is you know a TikTok influencer and she has a that she shows up like she says in this Google search if I search for you know TikTok what did she say to search for uh she said to search for I don't know if that's the same thing still if you search for TikTok consultant okay, let's try that I wonder I don't know what it says now but TikTok consultant let's see does that still show her up consultants learn about TikTok marketing TikTok marketing so she's not there oh I guess there's still no organizational no glass door yeah so she's not showing up as the top anymore but that's that's okay it was back then it was and TikTok has grown up a lot since then right but and that's the thing so I mean if if we look at this this case study if I look at these comments let me see I mean it was just a bunch of people look at that everybody's saying I want the case study I want the case study I want the case study I should probably start I should probably reply to these people and tell them to go to oh my god there's so many I should probably actually reply to get them to get that case study right I mean but anyway so that, that's the thing so it's been a whirlwind so that's so okay so let's go back how do you get an influencer to work with you so first you got to be producing content you got to be talking about your thing you got to be talking about your thing got to be posting content you got to be talking about it as if they're you don't need the influencer you can't be expecting them you can't be uh, you know sending messages and expecting them to reply because you know let's face it they're influencers they got millions of followers they got hundreds of messages a day they don't have time necessarily to go through all your messages and, and look at everybody's comments and everybody and everything that's going on on the social media platform right they don't have time they can't it's not humanly possible they even if they hire <laughs> hire a team to do it they might not even see your your thing anyways or they might not you know so what's important is for you like for me with my my content I'm I'm basically always posting and commenting and I'm creating content regularly I've got a blog uh if you haven't seen it before it's uh, jeansergegagnon.com I mean on that blog 
I post a video and a blog every single day right and do I have my uh no I don't know anyways it's jeansergegagnon.com and that's that's you know that's my blog right let's uh, let's make this a little bit smaller whoops so you can kind of see it a bit better there so I mean that's my blog right I mean that I I create and so a well, blog is one thing right blog is great but you really want to be posting content on Facebook regularly right you want to be posting not I'm sorry not Facebook I just mean on social media platform you want to be posting regular content whether it, it doesn't matter which platform it is but if you want an influencer to work with you you got to be posting on a, the platform they're on now in my case this is an influencer I didn't even know existed at the time she reached out to me so you never know right you might you might be connect trying to connect I mean I'm trying to connect obviously to lots of influencers I'm commenting on their stuff you know liking their stuff you know engaging with their things sending them messages that kind of stuff I'm doing that all the time but I'm not actually expecting them or needing them to make me a star or whatever you want to call it right so I'm not doing I'm not doing it for that reason I'm doing it to connect I'm learning how to connect I'm learning how to communicate on social media I'm learning how to produce content the more I produce the more you know better I get right I learn more and more as I get closer <clears throat> and closer to you know being being the 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 the, the the, how can I put it the the influencer myself right <clears throat> so I'm growing I'm growing and I'm getting to that point where I can get to be an influencer right so I mean like for this look so she posted these things where she does these weird things with with glass because that's one of that's her business so she shows these things um on how to like this is a obviously not something somebody's gonna eat but they're putting glass inside of an egg McMuffin right or a sausage McMuffin and just showing what it what it does just and that gets millions of views right and now she's doing this this uh this uh tick uh challenge where you throw a, a hair thing on a pop can and it, it falls and it holds onto it right now obviously that's using TikTok editor you can do that with a pause and as you can you can see a little bit there that you know let's say the bed for example changes when it so that's because it's but anyways it's still pretty cool to see that right so she's posting stuff about TikTok. she's posting all sorts of other things too but let me get back so first you have to be producing content regularly you got to be you got to be out there you got to be seen you got to have people see you so just post content post content post content create content post content create 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 do that that's the one thing you got to do second thing is you got to do do it not expecting an influencer to reach out not needing an influencer to to make you have the success because whenever you take the action eventually something's going to happen and it could be one of the influencers you're connecting with you're reaching out to regularly whatever but it could also be somebody that comes out of the blue that connects with you that wants your you know they they see you they see what you're doing they see they see some of the stuff you're doing and they they see the what it can bring them right the third thing is don't wor don't worry about the uh how can I put it the 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 the, the rewards from it there's going to be rewards from working with an influencer no matter what you don't need like me I don't care I could have given a hundred percent of the course to her um it's not about that we kind of she kind of suggested 50 50 I'm like okay yeah that's probably fair let's do 50 50 whatever <clears throat> because she does bring a lot of credibility she brings a lot of knowledge she brings lots of background she brings lots of followers and that helps me right so I don't need the money from the course or from the the trainings but it's it's so don't don't you shouldn't need it you should not need that because if you need it then it becomes really hard it becomes a focus it becomes you know problem right so that's that's what you do to get an influencer to work with you is you don't reach out you don't bug them you don't talk to them you don't try to get them you know get them on to your stuff right you just you just connect you just connect you just get there and that's that's what you do right you connect to uh, the the influencer is the person that you want to connect with they don't need you and you should not need them either if you need them 
it probably doesn't work that good all right so that's that's how you do it you just keep producing content you keep connecting and then it'll eventually happen and you don't you don't act or you, it's not about acting it's about you 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 mustn't need them inside you don't if you need them it, it's not going to work all right so hopefully this helped and if you want to know how to reach out to an influencer just go ahead and watch this episode listen to the podcast and read the blog and we'll see you in the next episode have yourself a great day my name is John Sergio until next time this has been course income secrets the entrepreneur's blueprint to generating income from the e-learning boom some of your friends need to hear this message so don't forget to share for more content like this go to courseincomesecrets.com and make sure to subscribe and follow us here my name is Jean-Serge Gagnon until next time